And as you guys get into ag and start to figure this is what you do, you guys need to sort of mess around and play around a little bit and experiment where we interact with one another, have that camaraderie that we've had since we were in the military, and we've accompanied that with the experts here in the state of Michigan. Michigan State University Extension experts help the farmer veterans succeed. When you look at soil health, in, so in soil you really want soil that, that has good aggregation. We certainly have the specialists on campus, and with Extension we have offices in almost all of the 83 counties in Michigan, so we can reach those veterans in their home communities and, and provide them with the resources and support that they might need to be successful in production agriculture. A lot of our farmer veterans don't have the luxury of being able to attend MSU, but being able to bring those expert services through Extension to our farmer veterans helps them become more successful and sustainable on the farm. And why exactly is this event so important? One common goal, everybody needs food. Food is probably one of the most important things that we have. I mean, when you have veterans and you have food together, you have one of the most important groups of people working with one of the most important things that we need in life. One of the things that, that really fits nicely with it right now is we have the local food movement. Oftentimes these farmer veterans have relatively small tracts of land and so they're looking at direct market type opportunities. Tom Barrett is a Michigan State Representative, a 16-year veteran and helicopter pilot. He also chairs the Military and Veteran Affairs Committee. And he knows one thing that ties farmers and veterans together is an outstanding work ethic. I mean, you can't really take any days off when you're serving in the military, and you can't really take any days off when you're working hard as a farmer either. So I think that work ethic is a great crossover between military service and then uh, in the agricultural field. And there's a responsibility. You have a responsibility to your battle buddies when you're in the military, and you have a responsibility to your crops or your livestock or to your livelihood, your family and everything else when you come home as a farmer. In addition to the workshop, Peterson Farms of Shelby, Michigan donated a 1976 C-65 flatbed farm truck to a post-9-11 combat veteran. Matt Van Wormer, a Marine veteran who served in Fallujah, was the grateful recipient. We never had a truck before, so um, this is really going to help out. Um, you know, we've always had to rent trucks or borrow trailers or, or, or whatnot, so this is really going to change things for us. One heartbreaking statistic, on average in the United States, 20 veterans commit suicide every single day. So I think that the best thing that we have as veterans is our network. Um, and our network is not just veterans, our network extends outside of that. So I think the, the thing that makes me happiest, the thing that makes me proudest to work with veterans is just knowing that once a veteran is in a good spot themselves, they're going to reach out and they're going to give the next guy a hand up. And that's, that's the only way we can solve this, this issue or this problem that we have. From Michigan State University, this is Craig M. Reporting.